Hey friends, Alan Lee here with Honestly Handyman Services out of Sacramento, California. And today I wanted to talk about another tool. As you can see, this is a little bit of a different uh, background than what I usually got. I'm actually inside my tool trailer. So uh, for this week, I wanted to highlight this awesome tool that I have here. If you guys don't know what this is, this is a, a Dremel Multimax. So this is a multi-tool. Um, almost every single brand of tools makes this tool. Um, I just bought this one because it happened to be on sale one day. Um, I did, I have tried the Milwaukee M12, um, and I didn't didn't really like it. It didn't really have you know enough power. I felt. What I love about this thing is, uh, if you guys have never used one of these, it takes many different blades. So this this here is, for instance, a drywall blade. This one's a wood blade. So if you've ever seen these kind of blades, then th that's exactly what this goes to. And so this basically mounts into here. And then when you turn it on, this little blade kind of does a little reciprocation motion. So you can cut anything. So say you even if you got a 2x4 here and you need to plunge cut it, you can turn it on and it will plunge cut into the 2x4. So it, it has many, many different applications. So like I said, and there's also many different blades. So this is a wood blade. It also has a metal blade. So designed specifically for cutting metal. It's got a drywall blade. It also has a grout blade. Um, so this is, this is used for cutting grout or... Uh, mortar between bricks or things like that um, has many different applications so I absolutely love this thing if you guys have seen my other videos you will see that I've used this thing uh, quite a bit I've even used it to cut plastic on certain items um, I'll, I'll link a, uh, a video up in up here so you guys can see um, see kind of this thing in, in use but I really like this thing uh, one thing that's pretty cool is it's got on the back here it's got this is the little tool that's used to change the uh, to change the blades so it's kind of cool because it you know, snaps in there. It's always on there, so you got it whenever you need it. So again, this is the Dremel Multimax MM30. So I was just at Home Depot. I saw they have the Dremel Multimax MM45 for the exact same price as the MM30. I think it's just, I think it's just right now it's on sale. So it's like, why not buy the one step bigger if you're gonna buy one at all? Um, but I will link in the description below um, a link to an Amazon affiliate link so you guys could purchase one of these off Amazon if you want to. I know there's many different brands that make this exact same thing and I think they all work great. I know Milwaukee has one, DeWalt has one, um, Makita has one. Um, this is just the one I got. This is a corded version uh, which I like better. Like I said before, I did try the Milwaukee uh, M12 version of it and I just really didn't feel like it had uh, enough power. I mean it died pretty quickly. Um, but yeah, these things have so many different deals. I've even used it to like cut um, cut copper plumbing um, that I, I couldn't get any type of saw or any cutter behind that I had to use this guy. And that's obviously not an optimal situation, but it definitely works when you're in a pinch like that as well. Um, one of the biggest jobs that I've ever used this on is I was, I was helping my brother-in-law install some hardwood flooring and this is great for cutting underneath the door uh, the door casing so you could slide the the wood underneath that that's probably the most common use for this tool um, but it has many many different other applications as well um, so I would love to highlight uh, some more tools for you guys I do a tool review every Wednesday um, so if you guys see any tools here uh, that you would definitely love me to highlight or maybe you have a question about it feel free to ask in the comment section below because I would definitely love to talk some more about kind of what I got going on here so this is my tool for the week uh, I got a link in the description uh, below for you guys to purchase this if you guys want to buy it off of Amazon and use the affiliate link. Um, but anyways, thank you so much for watching this video. Don't forget to like this video and uh, subscribe to my channel. Thank you all so much and have a great day.